If you're just joining us, this is Entertainment News and Channels Television, your one-stop shop for all that you need to know within the bubbling world of entertainment. Thank you so much for joining me on the program. Now, we have Sempe singer Mel Rouge to help us go through some mm. of the trending news from the Nigerian showbiz world. Thank you, Mel, for joining Thank us. Thank you for having me. Now, so much has been happening lately, and yeah. chief of that is Mr. Easy's assertion that the influence on Nigerian music from Ghana cannot be overemphasized. Mm. Now, that drew him a lot of backlash from Nigerian fans. But on a neutral note, how did you receive that tweet? To be honest, um, I was quite shocked. Just following on from, you know, he had an amazing concert in December, which, you know, it was basically sold out. So I wasn't expecting that. But I feel like as an artist, we express ourselves. We like to throw a spanner in the work. So I wasn't too surprised. Yeah. Okay, no, but it's established that yeah. High Life music originates from Ghana. Yes, it does. But outside High Life, how much influence do you suppose Ghanaian music has on today's mainstream music? That's an interesting one. To be honest, I mean, we've seen for a long time that Ghanaians and Nigerians, we have great camaraderie, but we have juju music, we have music that Fela gave. So I don't, I wouldn't say, I think it's fair to say that Ghanaian influenced all Nigerian music. They definitely, you know, contributed their own, but I wouldn't say that they um, gave everything. Yeah. Are you ready? If you give your heart to me, I don't go let you go. Where I don't go do you, basa basa, baby, trust in me. When you give your heart to me, I don't go let you go. Where I don't go do you, basa basa, baby, trust in me. I go do your body like skin tight. Where I go do it by your side. Ten times when I don't get to see car, you do it by my side. So make a day your body like skin tight. Where I go do it by your side, cause then. Before now, Mr. Easy has enjoyed good reviews in Nigeria. Do you suppose this could affect his reception henceforth? No, I wouldn't say that. I mean, we love him. He is a Nigerian man. And I don't think that one comment is going to change much. Especially with Twitter, like there's posts like every five seconds. I don't think one is going to put too much. So we're going to just forget so about it soon. We may not forget, but you know, it's not going to make us be like, I'm not going to, I'm going to unfollow you. I'm going to unfollow you. No, it, he'll be fine. I'm sure. Okay. As a singer, do you draw musical influences from foreign acts yourself? Yeah, hundred percent. I feel like as a creative, and we're inspired all the time. Even like a legend like Fela, even he was inspired by James Brown. So, you know, there's always other acts that we take, maybe the music or the style that we draw from, so definitely 100%. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much for joining Thank us. Thank you program. for having me. <laughs> on the home run, Memories of Elvis Presley comes alive as festival celebrates the life and times of the rock and roll king. 